making moves for better neighborhoods and better roads. A lot of money has been set aside now to make Cleveland a better place to live and drive. Meg Shaw is live in Cleveland, and Meg, this is a big deal. Yeah, Katie and Terrence, for years our investigators have been telling you about abandoned homes and pothole, pothole filled streets across our city. Well, now the city council is setting aside millions of dollars to help with both of those issues here in Cleveland. Starting with the vacant houses, the city has actually been really aggressive in the past couple of years with getting these homes down, demolishing more than 800 structures uh, since May of 2017. But there are many abandoned and nuisance homes still standing. So this move uh, may help get some of those down a little bit faster. According to the plane dealer, it looks like $14 million will be used uh, for 2019 demolition projects. And as for roads, they plan to put $8.6 million towards resurfacing streets. That's another problem uh, we've spent years talking to you about. Countless residents have shared their frustrations with us uh, about the roads and some roads have been patched. Some have been filled and others uh, were just left a bumpy crater mess and it seems like almost every spring crews have trouble keeping up with filling all of those potholes. So this 8.6 million that was set aside for that, that should help with repaving uh, this money to pay for both of these issues uh, for these city improvements is coming from jobs that were left vacant this year and tax collections that exceeded this year's uh, projections. And again, this is all money that is coming out of this year's budget. But then early next year, uh, Mayor Frank Jackson will present his budget for 2019, and that must be in place by March of 2019. Live in Cleveland, Meg Shaw, News 5.